Hi all, it's Dyla and welcome back to the next instalment of Pokemon Reborn's Wonder Squad. So last time I managed to get myself a Marowak as a Wonder Trade, and I think in this episode I'll be chasing after L and taking on the wonderful Arceus, or Arceus. Um, so why am I in Tanzan Depths? That's a good question. Uh, I'm not in the right place. Oh, I remember I was training. I was training. I shall show you what I was doing. I've, as you can see, I've trained it up and evolved it at night time. So I've got an Alolan Marowak. Let's get the speed up button off. So I've trained it down here because there's a lot of defense Pokemon here. So I've got quite a bit of attack and defense. Obviously, it's worth not worth putting anything in speed. Its speed is pretty woeful, 61. But that might be an advantage because... Radimus is Jim, he tends to like to use Trick Room, and that might backfire against him because you're not going to get any slower than my team. So that's, oh, I show its moves as well. So I've trained it all the way up to 56 so it's ready to fight. If I can just press the right button for once, I'll show you its moves. It's got a lonely nature. It's not bad at all. Obviously, I did have a thick club in my bag. I can't remember where I got it from. I picked it up from somewhere. So that's going to help because I think that doubles its attack. Which means it's a bit of a monster. So I've given it Will-O-Wisp, Stomp Tantrum, Shadow Bone and Boomerang. Now I've got two ground moves on it. Um, the reason I've kept Stomp Tantrum on it, it's not as powerful as Boomerang. However, it does have the advantage of removing the field effect in Radimus' gym. So it might be very useful for that. Because obviously all the psychic moves that Radimus fires at you have um, rock um, side or extra typing. So therefore, for example, my fire Pokemon here would be weak to that, and so would my Mac Cargo. So if I can get rid of the, um, the field, I think it might help me. Although it's going to prevent Absinthe from setting up quite so well, but I think on balance, removing the field effect might be the best option. But I've not got a bad team now, it's pretty good. Having said that, I've still got to get past the level 75 Arceus, so... It's going to be a bit of a pain. It's going to be a nuisance. So I haven't thought of an, a way of um, getting through that yet. Anyway, I'll get back out of here and I'll head to the Grand Stairway and we'll meet up with the guys there and follow L. Okay, I've made my way down to the Grand Gates and I've just seen L scurrying to the left as I look at it. No, that that left, that way. That way he's gone. Anyway, um, quite strange as well. I did notice a couple of um, wild Pokemon around Tanzan Cove that held elemental seeds. But it's, see, I think it's impossible to actually take them off them because as soon as the Pokemon spawns, the elemental seed is used immediately on entering the battle, so there's no way you can take it off it as far as I can figure out anyway. It'd be quite handy because obviously you can't buy any for a while. But uh, I've got the 8th uh, department store floor now open to me so I can now buy battle items so I've stocked up a bit. Which is going to help things considerably. This is Herbert doing again. Just to the south is Grand Stairway. Ah, yes, of course. Why is it lucky? Because no one's catching me sleeping in here. Hold on. That's not going to last long, matey. Can I in here? No. Kane. I saw him too. It would seem our culprit has been cornered. Where did he go? Did he use an escape rope? I think not. Press forward, I believe there's just enough space beyond that gear. Okie dokie. Come on, Fatso. It's more challenging for an adult of his stature. It's because he's got a big hat on. Hmm? Are you really stuck? He's stuck all right. Come on, Ant. Presumably these mechanisms are linked to the doors themselves. Many have tried to get them to operate again, but to no avail. Well, whatever. Even if it's tight, just force your way in. <clears throat> that, that could be a little rude. I mean, I don't normally say that to boys, but this is different. <laughs> Here we go. Smack. Bye bye, Kane. Well, now I've done it. Actually, it would appear that the drop isn't too far. Only 50 feet. It seems to lead to some kind of cave. I'm ready to go diving with you, Radimus? Of course. Let's go. Kaboom. There he is. No sign of our friend. Perhaps he wandered off in search of an exit already. And it looks like it's our move. Everything's move related, isn't it? Everything's chess related. Take chess away from him and be nothing. Okay, so I'm going to um, explore all this a lot because there's quite a lot of hidden items here. 
and head my way down to the main event. I'll see you there. Right, so I'm about to dive into the main bit of story that was this place called the Astri di Well, I can't remember, some Frenchy sounding name anyway. Um, but I still think this is going to be a fairly major part of the story later on. I think this might be where Lynn is holed up the whole time. I'm still not quite sure how I'm going to take out this Arceus. I might have to go with Harry Armour up front and maybe just go for a, a fake out to take a bit off it. I got fake out back in the now. I maybe knock off to get rid of the leftovers. It's all about surviving a hit. It's a it's a it's a real toughie. I'm not bad phys uh, it's the trouble special attack. And Harry Armour's not very good specially defensive, so it could be taken out first hit. So a knockoff would be a good one to get out. I've got the Atlax incense on it, so it's possible to miss me. Uh thereafter it's gonna be quite tough. It really is. Marowak's probably not a bad shout. Actually, no. no it's going to be really tough. Well, maybe between them all we can whittle it down, but I'm always going to go second. And there's always a good chance we can just one hit KO you. So, ugh, it's going to be. It might take a few goes with the Lax Incense up front before it misses me, and I can not get rid of the knockoff, the um, leftovers, and whip it down from there. But mm, it's going to be fun. Anyway, here we go. So this is where you've gotten to. Uh, he's found the Xanadu. And hello, it's Adrienne and Gossip Gardevoir. Not. <laughs> okay. No one's really pursuing him. Um, he told you a pack of lies that his dead daughter was kidnapped and he's brainwashed. La -di -da -di -da. And he's got hold of your Gardevoir. But it's not a Gardevoir. It's a bloody ditto. There's going to be an Arceus and it's going to kick my ass. I beg your pardon? So Gardevoir doesn't seem to care for you as a trainer at all. Yeah. She's always been afraid of him. And that's how it is. It was all a show. It's all false. It's all lies. Yeah. Truth is, I was glad when Elle stole me away. And there you have it. I can't forgive someone for being so cruel to such a sweet Pokemon as Gardevoir. And I will definitely protect her. Oh yes, and we get, we get some item stolen. We have the Amethyst Pendant and the Ruby Ring stolen, don't we? Amethyst Pendant goes... <laughs> These items rightfully belong to L. Oh dear. Oh, they only got one, didn't they? That's right, I've still got the other. So, one key is necessary to reach the Eri, so I was supposed to get both of them. Thieves and liars seldom relinquish things so easily. Go on, Adrian, you can see through this charade. Okay. They're laughing, right? And Radimus, I'll remember it. We'll be friends later, don't you worry. That was strange. Yeah. <laughs> all right, then, let's get moving. Perhaps this will be an interesting game after all. Oh, do be. Oh, it's boring me to death, these chest references. Right, another little area to explore and a couple of mining rocks. See if I get some goodies. I got loads of some star pieces from the last section. About eight, I think it was. So that's going to be worth a, a few quid for me. Which is excellent news. So um, let me just run away from this unknown. Uh, hopefully, maybe. Because I'm pretty damn slow. And I'll catch... Oh, logic puzzles next. Oh, oh great. Right, I'll see you there. Well, I've scoured this area now. I've now got 11 star pieces. Which means I can now reti retire... And I've got probably enough shards now to clear out the, um, when you get to 7th Street, get all the Pokemon freed so I can get the Lucky Egg and that. So, pretty good. And obviously his ability caps was down there for sale as well for, for shards. So, I need a few of them. It's always handy to shuffle your abilities around. Anyway, L says, what did you do to Gardevoir? Do not defile this holy place with your unintelligible shouting. Okay. Okay, so next up we have to do these gorgeous little logic puzzles. Can I remember how to do them? Mm, maybe. Oh yeah, this is an interesting bit of course. But uh, So Adrienne's been down here for only an hour and then he said almost immediately I saw a girl climbing up the cave wall. Now that must be Lynn. And then Elle and Gardevoir appeared. 
And now all of you, this is a secret tour spot. So it's obviously some sort of time dilatancy going on here as well, because uh, 10 years have passed, but he's only done it for, for that. So quite strange goings on, but obviously whatever power this meteor has, and of course we're talking about BB Arceus later on, um, it's quite profound. So I'm sure it will all be revealed in due course. So anyway, Kane Witters on is that first boy or girl, and he's quite turned on anyway. So we've got the ruby ring to open up the door. Ta -da. And then we've got the little little chimchar puzzle and that to do. Okie dokie, light becomes dark as dark becomes light. Truth becomes hidden, twisted and lie. Each power its own seeks to impart itself up to the innocent heart. Those of the light speak only the truth, those of the dark speak within lies. The divine will distinguish and ably sleuth the right from the wrong, the lies from the truth. You weren't confused before, you are now. Jim Shah says, Monfona always tells the truth, but if it has aligned with the darkness, I think you're light. I think. I think you're dark. And I think you're light. I thought it was. Isn't it? Hang on. I thought you were light. Dark. I'm sure that was right. Did I look like it? Let's go. Ah, okay. That's the one. <laughs> oh, yes, rare candy time, isn't there? So I don't understand why these ones here. Clapper Troop speaks the truth. Ah, da da da. But there's no, there's no choosing here. So why is this section here? You just give me a rare candy. That'll do me. Let's get candied up. And out here now. Yo, Adrienne! Elle and Gardevoir have continued to the Eri. I'm supposed to take the ruby ring from you so you can follow us. Will you give it to me? I'll say yes, because I know you're a good guy. Oh, what are you saying? Die laughing? That belongs to Heather. You can't just give it away. Oops. You said something about that about the Amethyst Pendant too. It really doesn't seem like you're lying. Elle insists they belong to him. Think about it, Adrian. Think about it. Who's the real bad guy? Wandering around for a little bit when he showed up. And they wouldn't open at all. What is this place? I fell down here and I was inspecting the Grand Gates for about an hour. But then there's this old ruin. He doesn't know what to make of it. I believe the answer will become clear as we press forward. Oh, I don't know about that. Which brings us back to the ring, huh? One of you is definitely lying to me, but who? I don't know what's up with Gardevoir, but Elle kidnapped her from Madamus. Luna wants to get her back. Okay, let's go. Elementary, my dear Adrienne, allow me. Here's the note. One da 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 if I was really so bad of a trainer to warrant to hate that guard of our confesses, would I have followed him here? I'm not going to lie, you didn't seem too happy to go at first. Here I am. None of this makes any sense. Okay. Let's go through the ruby door. Okay. Um, Adrienne, can I ask you something? Yes. Are you a boy or girl? <laughs> He's genderless. And Kane's a bit confused and a little turned on, of course. Good old Kane. Okay, so next one, isn't it? Oh, hang on. Sorry. I'll go through here now. Oh, okay. Hitman is a liar. Um, this one is light. Dark. Light and dark, I think. In memory. It worked! God, that doesn't usually work. I usually get these things wrong. Okay, it's going to be a big crunch time. So, I mean, I could bypass the whole battle altogether, but where's the fun in that? Right. We'll confront them in a moment. Let me just prepare myself. 
Righty ho, ooh, back to Sart Astre. Let me have a look at my team. What are we going to go for? Let me have a look. Yes. What I'm hoping to do is to knock its leftovers off with the first hit from all that ass. And take it from there, really. It's going to be tricky, mine. It's going to outspeed me every time. I'm going to need a bit of luck here, I think. No, I'm going to need a lot of luck. If I could burn it. I might better get a, um, a will-o'-wisp off on it. It's going to be quite tricky. It's going to be tricky. Okay, let's spin through this, but I'm hoping to uh, get this finished and maybe get the gym done in this episode, but I don't know. It depends how the battle goes. I can get through it fairly quickly. Anyway, God of Art. Oh, shall we begin? Oh, all right. Everyone appears as if by magic. As I thought, the door to this innermost sanctum will not open without all four keys. So, Adrienne, you failed to detain them. Some unanswered questions, L. Questions, answers, such meaningless words of humans. You are a human yourself, though, L. I'm sure. Kind of. This is a holy place. Not a place for trifles. Oh, I like a bit of trifle. Beyond this gate lies that from whose dreams our world unfolds. Behold, O oh unworthy ones, the birthplace of Arceus. For it is known that the god of Pokemon did create unto the earth. I hate religious prattle. Okay. Let's just skip through this. Just skip through it because it goes on and on and on a bit. Let's get the battle done. Let's just get the battle. I mean, I could skip it, but I'm not going to. I'm going to have a go for it. Radimus, you're an awful monster. How long are you going to keep this up? <laughs> okay. He's a callous, two-faced swine. My goodness. It's, it is an awful lot of dialogue. Okay, come on. Doesn't seem to care. Who are we going to pick? Doesn't get it at all. They're laughing. What do you think? Should we side with L or with Radimus? Radimus, of course. All right. I trust you on that one, Die Laughing. Very good. I'm relieved that I am not the only one to whom this charade is transparent. What? Translucent. Charade? What are you talking about? Isn't your reason for remaining with L the accusations of my Gardevoir? However, you've never met her. But she's right there. She's been talking all along. Is she really, L? So you knew all along, did you? Ew, no. It's a ditto. Unlike the riddles in this ruined towers, light and truth do not always go hand in hand. I'm sure our friend Adrienne can attest to. Things aren't that black or white. Sometimes light can be even more blinding than darkness. Yes, okay, okay, you're so smart. Look into my eyes. They're white, wait. He's blind, but blind no more. So this obviously, again, is giving us a clue to the power of this shrine or what's within it. Some magic. Now I will deign to borrow its power once more. This is going to be tricky. Here we go. Now then, do I go for a fake out first? I think I will, just to take something of it. You will silence the heretics. Okay, Al, here we go. Can we knock this thing out? Have I made a mistake in even doing this? Should I have just bypassed it? Right, let's give you a fake out, just to take a bit off it anyway. Didn't do a lot, did it? Yeah, see? Waste of time, really. Right, I really need this knockoff to take that leftovers off. Am I going to live a judgment? Probably not. She has. Right, so that's bad. And um, what can I do? I'm going to try and burn it. No, I'm not going to live that either. Do you know what? I might have better beat this with this team. Unless it disabled his um, Shadow Ball. But, 
can I do? Gooper, um, flamethrower, maybe burn it. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. It's just a one hit KO for every Pokemon. Um, let's try and paralyze it, perhaps. If I can survive a turn, maybe. Hmm, I don't think I can stand up to this. Why didn't I just side with L? Absinthe, what can you do, babe? Not a lot. Not a bloody lot. Let's try Calm Mind. Nope, that's going to kill me. Um, oh, I lived. Well, I'm going to have to heal and hope it does less than half so I can do another Calm Mind. Damn. Damn, damn, damn. Um, I think I'm, I think I'm doomed. You hit me with a Shadow Ball and you get me out of... Maybe I should lead with that and try and disable. Oh, see, it's done over half. I'm not going to survive, am I? I'm not going to survive through Calm Mind, so I'm pretty much at it. No. How can I beat it? This is going to be impossible. Sherry Top, what can you do? Um, well, the only chance I've got is a berry drum. It's the only chance, but I'm not going to live. I didn't even scratch it. Wow. Every single Pokemon, more like only one Pokemon, survived one hit. I'm going to have to have a think about this one. How the hell am I going to beat it with these Pokemon? All right, let me come back. Give me a minute. Okay, I returned, um, I got sent all the way back to Tanzan Cove, which was blooming annoying. So I decided to put Paws and Claws up front with a Amplified Rock to try and set up Light Screen and then Misty Terrain, if I'm lucky enough. I doubt well, I may not last that long, but we'll give it a try. Um, all that ass might come in then, and I think it's worth a fake out, actually. Didn't do anything, did it? I want to try and use knock off though to try and get rid of that leftovers. But I don't know how the rest are going to take it out. I've given these two, I've got bright powder on the Marowak to try and make it miss. Although that does halve my um, attack though. And I've, got, I've got Misty Train up, I can't will a whisper. So I'd have to go for Stomp Tantrum or Boomerang. Uh, very difficult. What do I do? I give it one more blast. I can still, I can still um, decline the battle. So if I fail a couple of times, I might have to do that because I can't, I can't see a way to win. Okay, let's just skip through the dialogue. What do you think? I might have to go for L, but we'll give it. We'll give it another couple of goes. Yes, yeah, yeah. Is Mister Train a good thing or not? I suppose it lowers judgment. Hmm. But I can't. The trouble is, I can't really hurt it. I've got nothing to hurt it with. That's the problem I've got. Unless I just go straight for a bloody close combat. I'm not going to take it out, that's the thing. It's going to be at least a three or four hit um, takeout. My Pokemon just can't last long enough to put that on it.
Yeah, maybe I should have just kept the thick club. I'll, maybe, I'll try it next time. Let's have a look, see what happens here. Okay. Let's go for a light screen. I get Prankster, so I go first. It's going to hit me with Judgment. So, of course, all his moves are enhanced with crystals, so I really could do with getting Misty. Jesus. Right, so we get Misty Train up anyway. That's going to lower him down. Right, so that did a lot. Right, so at least like that, you've done your job. Right, I don't know which one to go for next, though. Let's go for you. I need to get rid of your leftovers to have any hope. Well, I did less than half, so... See how little that did? Do I just go for Force Palm? I might get lucky with the Paralysis. And I've got... See the old Lax Incense? Of course it's not working this time. Ah, oh, I needed the Paralysis. Is it worth me healing? I did quite a chunk, that. I might do that. I might just heal up. Have I got to, f I need to fully heal myself? Do I have any falls? Ultra might do that. See what happens here. Oh, not quite enough. Ah, da -da 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 -da. ah light screen's gone as well now. And take me out. Not once did my lax incense work that time. That's a damn shame. What can I do? Thing is, it's just going to one hit KO everybody. Can't do anything to it. Come on, Cooper. We do the burn here. Quick call, come in. I need a burn. I need you to miss. Jeepers. Down right down in the yellow. I need a bit of luck, didn't I? I need some luck. Come on. I might just survive another one. Yes! Whew. Wow. That was tough. Parson L, eh? Thou defiest me. Shut up. I hate you. Well, there we are. I managed to get through, but crikey. As but a false idol, it cannot hope to mimic the true Lord's power. How very funny. <laughs> so, if it was Ditto, where was the real Gardevoir? Where indeed? It looks like it's my move now. Gardevoir, teleport now. Are you allowed to do that in chess? Oh look, your king's in checkmate. So, it's the real Gardevoir at your service. Miss me? <laughs> Hypnosis, Kadoom, one hit KO. Again, very funny. Case, case is closed. Take him down the station. If you could have just had Gardevoir teleport at any time, why bother coming all the way down here? Because it was fun. It was fun. It would have been too easy. It's like in a film. It's, oh, why didn't they just do that? Well, then you haven't got a film anymore. Okay, let's just skip through this. I don't think I'm going to have time to do the gym today, so I'm going to have to do a wonder trade fairly soon. Let me just escape from here. The 
Good Cheney. Thank you. Badly needed. I picked up the rare candy, didn't I? I did. So I think we can just escape and get the little bit of dialogue. The very enigmatic dialogue as you leave this area. Let's just remind myself what it says. Hee hee hee! This is fun. Hey everybody, come back and play again sometime. Okay! Let's keep playing together for a long, long time. Isn't that right? Hee hee hee. <laughs> yes. So, scratching heads, but I'm wondering if that's um, the child Lynn talking. Enhanced with the power of baby Arceus. Not sure. Well, it all will be revealed. I can't wait. I can't wait. Okay, so let's head out here and just finish the bit of dialogue and then I'll do a wonder trade. Okay, so I'll quickly skim through the dialogue and then we'll have to do a wonder trade. I was hoping to get to the gym before this, but uh, it doesn't look as though I have got enough time really. Uh, we're over the half hour mark, so I must do a wonder trade. That's my rules, in-house rules. It's a shame really because the team I've got, or the squad I've got, I can actually work with. It's not bad. You know, I've got lots of um, things I can try. Um, so it could get worse. Probably will. <laughs> let's let's just get through this. So Adrienne is relieved to be above ground. Fresh air. And off he goes. And does anyone notice anything strange? Grand gate. It's open. He suddenly opened. Let's go check it out. Oh, I could I could just go and do one to trade straight away. Oh, no, I can't. More dialogue. Okay, what's this? The Grand Stairway. It's clear. Okay. Got roughed up. But the whole city. It's a mess. He's confused. Because when he left this morning, it was pristine. And now, it's all messed up. It's brown. It's polluted. It's cankerous rot. It's taken a while. Something happened to his gym? Off he goes. Let's go to his gym. Yep. Let's go. All oh, right. Okay. I'm, I'm going to um, just go and wonder trade now then, I think. I'll skip the dialogue because we all know what the dialogue is. So Adrienne is going to repair the city, the whole city. It's going to be made good. So I'll just quickly, I'll, I'll run through off screen because we all, we all know the dialogue. So what I'll do is I'll array the guys in one to seven order, and I'll do a wonder trade. Right, so I've lined them all up, one to seven in my squad box, starting at one here, going ding, 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 to six and seven. No particular order. Uh, I suppose what I would like is a four. Puzzle is fairly weak. I wouldn't, I would, don't want to lose any of the others, but I'm going to have to. Right, let's chuck a... I don't want to lose a... I don't want to get a two. Two would be a bad number. Let's generate a number. It's a four. It's... I'm lucky again. Little puzzle. Alrighty. Two bits of luck consecutively. I can't believe it. That's never happened. I must be in for a bad... I'm going to get a bad run next. Got to. That's twice in a row... I've got the number I wanted. Wow. Okay, let's go on to, whoops, a daisy. Online play, save the game quickly. And because I'm getting rid of the crap Pokemon, I don't really care what I get. I've got a good six, so I'm good. Okay, party popper. Off you go. I do, I do, I do. Shin yo yisin jisin? Crikey, it's a mouthful. Okay, bye bye, bye bye. Spritzy. All right, I can make that work. Thank you. Let's have a look at our spritzy. 
It doesn't look as though it's been used at all. Very few of the Pokemon that I get given over to me have actually been used. Not a single I, um, a bit of training look. Alright, so it's a healer. Mediocre sets, just average I suppose. Bashful nature, it is another fairy. That means I've got three lots of fairies. Building up a fairy team. So Misty Terrain might be the way to go for future. But that's good. Uh, I can use that, definitely. That'll fit in okay. Right, I will train that little baby up, and next time we'll be taking on Radamus's gym. So it shouldn't be too bad. Uh, obviously, I've got the ability to get rid of the terrain and the stomping tantrum, or I could use Misty Terrain. So there's, I, there's ways I can manipulate things. So that's not too bad. Right, I'll see you guys on the next one. See you soon.